Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm showing you guys my Halloween costume and what I decided to be on Halloween on 2021 is a 1920s gangster, and I must say, I look good. So I want to tell you guys how and where I got my costume. So at first, I wanted to buy a costume online, but... My mom decided she wanted to take me to a Halloween store nearby where I live and stuff like that because, you know, it'd be a lot easier and hopefully a lot cheaper. So we went to this Halloween store called Spirit Halloween, and I've been there before. I think I've been there like last year, maybe a year before last year, and I thought it was the coolest place I have ever seen. It had a bunch of cool, creepy mechanical zombies and Frankenstein and a bunch of cool stuff like that. I thought it was amazing. It still is. So the this gangster costume was one of them and it's a male costume. It's just like a little jacket, tuxedo. It came with a tie too, but I decided to wear an undershirt with it um, for today's video. And this hat, this fedora didn't come with it either. This is actually a different fedora. So my mom had to actually buy me a hat because it because she said it matches the whole costume. And uh, she's right, even though I'm not much of a hat person because I have a hard time finding hats that fit because I got a big ass head. She had to measure my head so she can get me this fedora and my head it's 24 inches. I got a big ass head. Bigger than Berlizzi's head. Bigger than a balloon head. Bigger than Pops from regular show. Maybe some, some other people got bigger heads than me, but I make kind of a big deal of, about my big head. I was never self-conscious about my big head, but I always knew my head was pretty big because my mom told me and I'm not ashamed of my big head. And I know that there are some people out there who have bigger heads than me or smaller heads, and that's fine. Some people can't help it. That's okay. And this glove didn't come with the costume either. It's actually an old Batman glove that I had in like a box filled with costumes, like old costumes that my brothers had, brothers and I had when we were kids. Like I remember back then I used to be Princess Peach, a fairy a vampire, a killer clown, a bunch of cool stuff like that. And um, after I turned like 13 or maybe 14, when I was in junior high, I didn't really dress up that much, but now I decided to dress up and look real badass as shit. And I thought this, um, this glove would go perfect with my costume. Even if it's not like, you know, gangster kind of thing. It's a Batman thing, but I thought it would look really cool still. And it's just one glove. So I'll find a way to make this work. So that is all I have to say for this week's video. And just to let you guys know, the reason why I'm showing you guys my costume this early is because I'm going to a Halloween party. Um, next week with my mom and it's going to be the first time I'm ever going to a Halloween party and I'm super excited. I'm just hoping nothing changes. I hope plans don't change because I hate it when change happens. So I just got to be prepared if anything bad happens and things change. So I thought it'd be a better idea to show you guys what I look like, what my costume is and stuff like that. So I won't be filming on Saturday, next Saturday, on the 20, was it 30th? I won't be filming on the 30th of next week on Saturday, so just to let you guys know. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And let me, let me, you guys, let me know, excuse me, let me know what you guys are going to be for Halloween um, this year, because I would like to know. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Peace!